Mule winds up on the floor, and the pass winds up in the hands of Aliyah Edwards. Mule is down, holding her left ankle behind the play. And it's going to be out of bounds, and Mule is down. She's had a problem with that ankle. And she's the toughest kid. So for her to be wincing like that, it, that's not good. Athletic trainer Janelle Francisco is out with Mule. And her way of dealing with it is just tighten her shoe. Ooh, oh, right you there. saw Ooh. her go over. And you can see she's got reinforcements, those ankle braces. She got knocked off balance a bit. Oh, got tangled up with Juhas. And Nika comes up very gingerly in trying to walk it off. And Gino has talked many, many times about her leadership and the spark and the energy she brings to this team. This would be a costly loss if she misses any kind of significant time for UConn, even in this ballgame. She, she, we've talked about this so much. She's not only the heart and soul, she's the grit, she's the toughness, the and junkyard dog, which Doug Bruno, the DePaul coach, calls her. She does everything for this team. And the primary ball handler, which with this Georgetown defensive pressure, that'll be something to watch here. So. If there's any way she can, she will. Coming back to the scorer's table is Nika she'll, Mule. She'll sub herself back in. There's Bennett from the corner for three. Players are not going away. Back into the ball game. Edwards is up, has adjusted the footwear. And we have three minutes and 27 seconds to go in this ball game that 